Let's simplify the fraction 8 fifths. And here's how we can do that. We're looking for another fraction that's equivalent to 8 fifths, has the same value, just that we've simplified it or reduced it down to its lowest terms. We need to find a common factor, something that goes into 8 and 5 evenly. And the only factor, the only common factor is 1. So we divide 8 by 1, we get 8. Divide 5 by 1, we get 5. And that's what we started with. What that means is that 8 fifths, we can't reduce this any further. It's already simplified. 8 fifths is an improper fraction in that the 8, the numerator, is larger than the denominator. So we could change it to a mixed fraction. Let's do that. 5 goes into 8 one time with 3 left over. We bring the 5 across. So 8 fifths, the improper fraction, that's equal to the mixed number 1 and 3 fifths. These have the same value. And you can check that. 1 times 5, that's 5, plus 3, that's the 8, and we just keep the denominator the same. But in answer to our original question, the fraction 8 fifths, we can't reduce this any further. It's already in simplest form. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.